Hi, I'm Susanna with the Pickleball Academy, and today we have a quick drill that's gonna help you practice your lob retrievals. Let's get right into it. All right, so for this quick drill, all we're doing is working on proper form for retrieving a lob. So key, we wanna be safe, right? We don't want anyone running backwards, tripping, anything like that. We don't wanna be running into our partner as well. So the more we can practice safely retrieving a lob, the better off we're gonna be. Very first thing that we need to do is work on how we pivot when we see that lob happening. So what we wanna do is we're typically going to pivot on our offside foot. So for me, that's gonna be my left foot, that's gonna be my, my grounded foot, and I'm gonna pivot to my right, okay? Actually turning somewhat around, keeping my eye on that ball, so I am judging where it's going, but very first step, quick pivot, that's where I put this cone here. So I'm pivoting towards the cone. From that, now I can run back, try to get around that ball, okay? So when we actually make our way back, and hopefully we've gotten back there far enough that now we can get this ball in front of us, our first choice, of course, would be to hit a good drop shot if, if we can, because we're trying to allow us to come back up. If not, we can drive it, we can lob it, we can do whatever it takes to get the ball back over the net, right? But the more we practice this, the quicker we get at seeing a lob and getting back there, the more chances we're gonna have to get an actual drop shot back, which is what we wanna do. Okay, so for the actual drill, we're gonna start out dinking. When you see a ball that you feel confident lobbing, go ahead and lob over me. I'm gonna be the one retrieving it, pivoting, trying to get behind the ball, bringing it back under control. Pretty simple, quick drill. All right, so there's our quick drill tip on retrieving a lob. Uh, we can obviously take turns, each of us working on retrieving. We can work on from the opposite sides of the court as well. The lobbing is becoming more and more popular, so this is a great drill to get out there and practice and be confident and comfortable when you do get lobbed. Thanks so much for watching, and I hope you can implement this into your game today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. And if you have any questions, concerns, or other things that you would like to see, let us know and we'll get back to you. Thank you again for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.